So over the last couple of years, we visited Portland, Oregon. We visited Boston. We are now going to be visiting Denver to learn about economic revitalization. We're visiting NUSED because we wanted to see where and how local communities can come together working with the city to provide income development, business development. We started this trip last year uh, visiting Boston and learning from some of the work that those communities have done to be successful and, you know, fast forward 30 years, what it can look like in Northwest Aurora. This visit to NUSED allows us to explore a community development corporation that is local in the heart of the country. For us in Northwest Aurora, all that leads us to have a very comprehensive understanding about why all these entities have had so much success and how we can emulate that if we really do this work in the right way in Northwest Aurora. They are 50 year old CDC nonprofit and they're located in the Denver metro area. And what they do revolves around helping small communities and also working to provide economic development, whether it's through housing, rental assistance, financial uh, assistance for companies and individuals. We're a very organic group of people who care a whole lot about the success of Northwest Aurora. Uh, I myself as a city council member, we have residents, we have business owners, nonprofit leaders. We work, live and play in Northwest Aurora and want to see that we um, are successful and that we minimize the level of harm and displacement, but also really acknowledging some of the critical challenges that we face as a community. I'm Andrea Barella. Um, I'm the president and CEO of New Said Community Development Corporation. The Zone Marketplace was established um, about 10 years ago. And what we did is, again, is another story of taking property that we used to lease and converting it to community use. And so what we wanted to do was provide um, individuals a turnkey approach, right, to starting and owning and operating and building a customer base um, for their retail business. We've had about 60 participants that have come and gone and, and participated in the program. And we have uh, created it as a two-year program. So when people come to the zone, they sign an agreement with us. They have to pay a little bit of rent, but they also have to pay a program fee. And with that, they get one-on-one um, -on -one financial literacy coaching. They get small business coaching. They get uh, introduced to uh, a lot of uh, resources and assets and grants available for their business. So they get a lot of attention, right, while they're with us. Right now, we have about 11 clients um, inside the zone. Um, I invite you to come down, check it out. If you're looking for a unique uh, gift of any kind, you want to support BIPOC businesses, um, it's a place to go. We also have a special program, very unique program, the only program of its kind in the state of Colorado that I'm aware of, um, called Lending Circles, uh, better known um, in Latino communities as Tandas, and it is a fantastic credit building tool. So basically what you do, the way Atanda works, it's a social loan program. You get together up to 12 people because it has to work within a calendar year. Everyone contributes an amount that they can afford into the circle. So let's just say for round numbers, you get 10 people, they can put, they can afford $100 a month. 10 people putting in $100 a month generates $1,000 every month. The circle of people decide who is going to get to use that money on what month. What happens is their payments get pulled out of their accounts automatically. When it comes to the individual's month who gets to use the loan, it gets, that money gets put into their account. So by the time the circle completes itself, you've already paid off the loan, you've already used the loan, and within about a six month period is when we start seeing vast improvements to their credit score. Their positive payments into the circle gets reported to all three credit bureaus. And it's great for young people that are looking to establish their credit. It's great for all communities. We'll come back and have meetings after this meeting with NUSED and start providing, well, what do we need to do next? And I think that's what I'm happy about. I'm really excited to, to build a relationship with NUSED, build a partnership, hopefully, um, have them uh, share what they've learned and to learn from them and just to be this like collaborative community where we share ideas, trials, tribulations, because I'm hoping that we, we have the same goal to really support our respective communities. Northwest Aurora and all of us who are going to be on this trip have a lot to learn and we hope that we can bring back some learnings so that we can apply them in Northwest Aurora.